moving on to our next example what will be the value of 1 by log 60 to the base 3 plus 1 by log 60 to the base 4 plus 1 by log 60 to the base 5 we have the options as 0 1 5 and 60 using the property log x to the base a is equal to 1 by log a to the base x we can also write it down as 1 by log a to the base x is equal to log x to the base a we can write down a question as 1 by log 60 to the base 3 plus 1 by log 60 to the base 4 plus 1 by log 60 to the base 5 as log 3 to the base 60 plus log 4 to the base 60 plus log 5 to the base 60 by interchanging your answer and your base as per the property. Again using the property log xy to the base a is equal to log x to the base a plus log y to the base a we can write down the right hand side of the equation to the left as log 3 into 4 into 5 to the base 60 3 into 4 into 5 is 60 hence log 60 to the base 60 as per the property is 1 hence your answer is 1 we have another interesting question over here which has appeared in gate and government exams let's look into it if your value of a power x is equal to b power y then which of these following conditions will hold we'll see the conditions log a by b is equal to x by y log a by log b is equal to x by y log a plus log b log a by log b is equal to y by x fourth option is none of this by using a property log m power n is equal to n log m we can write down a given equation as by applying log log a power x is equal to log b power y using the property we can write down x into log a is equal to y into log b bringing your log terms to your left hand side and your variables to your right hand side log a by log b is equal to y by x which is your option c hence option c is your answer our next question we have to find out the value of log 16 to the base 2 the options are 1 by 8 4 8 and 16 let us assume the value of log 16 to the base 2 to be n this can be written as per the logarithmic form as b to the power n is equal to a that is 2 to the power n is equal to 16 which is nothing but 2 to the power 4 hence your n value will be 4 that is your log 16 to the base 2 has its value to be 4 which is option B and here note it down it has appeared in bank exam and SSC and IBPS and HCL Our next question goes on like this log y to the base x is equal to 100 
and log x to the base 2 is equal to 10. Then what will be your value of y? If we have the options as 2 power 10, 2 power 100, 2 power 1000, 2 power 10,000. This is an important one as it has appeared in GATE, Government Exams and CAT. So from the given data, we can write down as log x to the base 2 as 10. By using a logarithmic form, 2 should be raised to the power 10 to get your value as x. Hence your x value is 2 power 10. And log y to the base x is equal to 100 as per the given information. This can be written as x should be raised to the power 100 to get your value as y. That is y is equal to x power 100. Substitute your value of x is equal to 2 power 10 over here. You will get your answer as y is equal to 2 power 1000 which is option C. Hence C is your answer. Thank you so much.